Hello, everyone, and welcome back to your boy, The Sean Davey Way Show. Please hit that like and subscribe on the way in and tap that bell if you would like to be notified of all of our future content. Today, I bring you breaking news. Sean Diddy Combs has been arrested. It is not a rumor. This is not a drill. He has finally been arrested. And without holding you any further, we're going to jump right into all of the details. Shout out to People Magazine. Sean Diddy Combs arrested in New York City after raids on his homes amid allegations and lawsuits. Sean Diddy Combs was arrested at a Manhattan hotel on Monday, September 16th. After he was indicted by a grand jury, sources confirmed to People. The charges in the indictment are unclear. The 54-year-old rapper was taken into custody following several months of ongoing SA and ST allegations against him. Quote, we are disappointed with the decision to pursue what we believe is an unjust prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office. Combs lawyer Mark said in a statement to People, Sean Diddy Combs is a music icon, a self-made entrepreneur, loving family man and proven philanthropist who has spent the last 30 years building an empire adoring his children and working to uplift the black community. He is an imperfect person, but he is not a criminal. Side note, although we've all seen the viral video of what he did to Cassie in the hotel, clearly he's a criminal, but I digress. Let's keep reading the quote. To his credit, Mr. Combs has been nothing but cooperative with this investigation, and he voluntarily relocated to New York last week in anticipation of these charges, his lawyer continued. Please reserve your judgment until you have all the facts. These are the facts of an innocent man with nothing to hide, and he looks forward to clearing his name in court. We learn a lot and kind of nothing at all at the same time, but let's pay attention to what we learned. We learned that he has been brought up on these indictments and has been arrested since the grand jury have determined that he will face these charges in court. We also learned that Diddy knew that he was about to be indicted, not only because of the federal raids that we all seen live, but also his lawyer said he relocated to New York to anticipate these charges with the indictment happening with the grand jury. So again, that is learning a lot. It's us knowing that Diddy knew these charges were coming, whether he has inside information or rather his judges have been having conversations with people that work at the courthouse, you know, brushing shoulders and whatnot, or he knows that he's guilty. He knows that he's about to go down. So it's better to just turn yourself in and look better than it does to be on the run. So Diddy is definitely in a lot of hot water with these charges and with the charges being unclear, I feel like there are a lot. I feel that there are so many charges that they can't even get them all together within this moment in time. It's, it's going to take them a few days to get to the basis of what he's going to be facing in court when there's just so much evidence, I believe, that they got in the raids against him. So I think this is going to be one crazy trial. This is going to be the trial of the century. So yeah, Diddy has been arrested. He's been apprehended. He's in custody as we speak. Mugshot coming soon. He's going down. Let me know how you feel in the comments about Diddy finally being arrested. I'm happy. I, you know, I, I just think that this is so necessary. It should have happened a long time ago when Tupac's life and Biggie's life was taken. You know, maybe a lot of this stuff could have been prevented if he was arrested a long time ago. So, yeah, let me know your thoughts below. He is gone.